You have hid so many things from us. Many things have been hidden from us. We have no clue. We have no idea. But you are urging us to prepare ourselves. Because your coming is close at hand. Beloved, let us pray. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, we thank you for this great opportunity given to us to enable us to walk perfectly in your ways. You draw us closer to other our steps and to show us how to live every day our lives. That when you come to collect your people, we shall be remembered. Take all the glory, we deserve the glory. And the honor, Lord, we lift us in worship. As we lift your holy name. You desire the glory and the honor. Lord, we lift our hands in worship as we lift your holy name. For you are great. You do miracles are great. There is no one else like you. There is no one else like you. For you are great. You do miracles are great. There is no one else like you. There is no one else like you. You deserve the glory. And the honor, Lord, we lift our hands in worship, as we lift your holy name. You deserve the glory, Shandere Bosakaya. And the honor, Lord, we lift our hands in worship, as we lift your holy name, cause you are great. You the miracles are great. There is no one else like you. There is no one else like you. You are great. You the miracles are great. There is no one else like you. There is no one else. Like you, you deserve the glory and the honor. Lord, we lift our hands in worship as we lift your holy name. You deserve all the glory and the honor. Lord, we lift us in worship as we lift your holy name because you are great. You the miracles are great. There is no one else like you. There is no one else like you because you are great. You the miracle so great. There is no one else like you. There is no one else like you. For you are great. You the miracle so great. 
There is no one else like you. There is no one else like you. Because you are great. You the miracle so great. There is no one else like you. There is no one else like you. Let's thank God for another opportunity given to us to come before his presence. Oh Lord, we thank you for that. In your presence there is fullness of joy at your right hand is pleasure for them that love it. We bless your holy name because you have become our son, our become our salvation. Blessed be to your name, O God Almighty. We thank you for this great opportunity to come before your presence. When I come into your presence, I'm so happy. Thank you, God. When I come into your presence, I am so glad. Lord. Because in your presence there is anointing. The bread and yolk in your presence. Anointing brings the yolk. When I come into your presence, I'm so happy. When I come into your presence, I'm I'm so glad in your presence there is anointing that breath the yoke in your presence anointing breath the yoke in your presence anointing breath the yoke Father shall we pray that every yoke in our heart shall be broken even as we come before him Shall we pray that heavens will be open to us to embrace the mind of God as we are about to declare His will to the dying world? In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, show us your way. Show us your glory. <laughs> Let the dew of heaven bring us the refreshment that we need. Fulfill your will in our lives. Thank you, Jesus. Worship you. I worship you. Almighty God. So there is none like you. I worship you, Prince of Peace. That is what I want to do. I give you praise. Cause you are my righteousness. I worship you, mighty, mighty, mighty God. For there is none like you. I give you praise because you are my righteousness. I worship you, Almighty God. There is none. Like you. Beloved, we are welcome into the presence of the Almighty God who has blessed us so much so well and have led us into his presence. I'm grateful unto God that he has brought us together to continue to study his word and to prepare ourselves for the coming of the Lord. Every time that we come before his presence, he has a message for us. Now that is something that thrills me for such a great opportunity. Say, Johnny, I bring you now, dear Bunny Nim. I might be hooning at Simpon. 
Onyame edeni ama bi ehintayen. God have hidden so many things from us. It is not hidden. It is hidden for those who don't want to come closer to God. Those who don't want to be part with anything that God is doing. Every now and then they will lose the mark of God. But you and me, we are so privileged. A privilege to draw closer to God. So that we might know the time and the season that he has set for his own works. Amen. Amen. Last night, the Lord spoke to Mama Sylvia. And the message was, it is left with his last trumpet to be sound. Meaning that very soon that trumpet could be sound. So she said when the Lord spoke to her, she was shivering. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the Lord wants us to know what He is doing. The Lord don't want us to continue to walk in his anger. The Lord wants us to cease from following the things of this flesh. Before Mama Sylvia spoke to me, I had already spoken to Brother Apia. He saw himself with me and many other brethren walking. He said we were very many. And I was preaching. And I and a voice was spoken to me that built me an altar. And I, or we built the altar. And after that, the Lord said, Now, separate, separate for me those that I'm coming for. Those who will listen to what you are saying and live with it, they will be part. Beloved, so the brother was saying that about half of the entire people that we were moving around were able to draw closer to where the altar was. Some ninety verse number eleven. Some ninety verse eleven. Who knows the power of your anger? Your wrath matches the fear you are due. Also, when you pray, so who also say, Oh, who's root here? So, teach us to number our days. 
My said it here. That we may present our heart for wisdom. Who knows the power of your anger? That is one of the areas that humanity are ignorant about. Therefore, we need to approach God with open hearts. With open mind. Genuine spirits. Willingness to obey the voice of God. Without excuses. The Lord doesn't want to come unprepared. Jesus, the Lord spoke to Pastor Henry and said, There is still more room in my house. Now, in a rough day, Pastor Henry said, there are more vacancies in heaven. Even if hell is closed and Hades is closed down. And they want to transfer all the people to heaven. Heaven is able to accommodate all of us. Beloved, let us begin to walk towards God. The psalmist said, teach me how to live my life. Ladies and gentlemen, this should be our prayer at this moment of our days. This must be our petition. That the Lord will enable us to take hearts in the last end of this life. Pastor, please come again. That the Lord will help us to take heart and to take the position to learn the lessons of this life. Amen. Amen. That we will cease from his anger. And we relent concerning them. We will stand and resist them. Amen. 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 Now we will embrace his mercy. That we may not afflict our souls with our sinful desires. God wants to show his glorious nature in us. But the enemy is always standing in the way. He doesn't want us to emulate his nature when he appears. Satan doesn't want the beauty of the Lord to reflect on us. He wants the Lord to curse us. And that is why David said, teach me how to number my days. And then see David said, Set a marking scheme, a calendar on my life so that I may know how to walk according to your will. Amen. 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 
Hallelujah. Amen. Beloved, the Lord Jesus said, It is love with his last trumpet to be sounded. For the four in the radio, the Christian said, I can't say, or be what a prevent to a chat to any more. Are you ready? So, Yaya Crado and Are you ready? Yaya Crado. Ladies and gentlemen, those who like to learn wisdom need to turn to the Lord. And you know, near the phone, more person will sing and son, and a sing and son, say, We join your court to a radio. We must pray for divine instructions at this end time. I was saying, the Bianca Diabon Pai said, I didn't see an amount of my aim. Instruct me! Instruct me! Show me your ways! Show me your time! Show me your season! If I got to a radis, a radis to my now, more mommy, not feature me, what quaint, share me, one not any woman. We must come to the Holy Spirit! The Holy Spirit, teach me! I was a Danny Diabon, Concorne, a stranger, and Concorne, a patch of Let's see comfort in him, not in men. Young pay a wretched own Concrumo, Nemo, and Yenipum. Let's see our approval in him, not in men. Young Castle, no one beddy at two, and yes, any pabedia too. Let us be ready for the joy of his appearance. Mama, and your cradle, Emma. Uh, Let us prepare for his divine favor. He said, Thou good and a faithful servant, you have been favored. Go into the rest of your father. We need to pray for the mercy of God and do what we are asking of Him. I was said that be a bomb pies or a day home bro. Now, dear, your bomb pies friend, no home, so we'll see it to me. A year. We are not here to pretend. And demand thing that we are not ready for. And I'm telling you, his favor will see us through. And he will safeguard us into the future that we are expecting. He will take away the grief of tomorrow. He will empower us a spirit that will enable us to work good works that will attract eternal reward. The Lord recently told Brother Emmanuel. And Satan has poured all that he has upon the demons to work for him. And in the same manner, the Lord has increased the proportionate of the ability that the Holy Spirit should give to us. The grace of God in us is more than enough to produce the light of good works that the Father is expecting of us. His divine constellation will put us into gladness in, the, in our heart that we will be able to fulfill in a different style and silence. Hallelujah. Amen. The Lord will destroy everything that He doesn't want to see in us if we make ourselves available. And He will brighten our countenance at the day that when He will appear. 
He will establish the works of our hands. And every work of righteousness will be established and be rewarded. Ladies and gentlemen, this is not a time to waste a precious moment of our lives. This is not a time to pursue the fleeting things that are soon going to be done away. Let's just leave everything that intend to possess us. And allow the Lord God Almighty to possess us fully. Let us give him the upper hand over our choices. Let us seek his forgiveness for our sins. And gain the answers into the inheritance that he had for us in heaven. We need to pray every day that the Holy Spirit will bring divine conviction that will bring conviction into our hearts. And so that the beauty of his holiness may be seen in our conduct. This is what King David prayed for. Let me know the number of my days so that I may know how to live. Do you know how many days left on this life? You will prepare adequately for that. Recently, a revelation was given to some sisters, two, three different types of the fourth revelation was even affirmed. And that Gabriel, you can leave this world very soon. Gabriel, so free and could be an Now, apparently, during that in that dreams of revelation, my wife and the church or the ministry was left behind to continue. Meaning that it wasn't the rapture that was going to rapture all of us. So when all this revelation was coming, I said, Lord, I am ready to continue what you have given to me to do. And it's a bread, Miss Wadi Minion, I cost on a patcher, what they said, what they my crowd of said, your dear shaman said, be an amateur, so I am. However, I started showing my wife, my bank account, my P number, my passcode, everything that she needs to know. My life insurance certificates and the policy. So as I come sit down, let me show you these things in case I die. Let me know the number of my days so that I may order my steps. Deuteronomy chapter 32 verse 29 says Deuteronomy chapter 32 verse 29 If only they were wise they would understand it and they will comprehend their faith If they are wise they will know their faith when I come. 
They will know where they will be. Those of you who want to travel, this is not a time to travel. Those of you who are pursuing worldly things, this is not a time for that. Whatsoever the Lord God has blessed you, hold fast to it. But bring it under the mighty hand of the divine preparation of the soon trumpet which is going to be blown. The Lord wants us to hide his commandment in our heart so that we may not sin against him. The Lord wants us to commit ourselves into his work by winning many souls for him. So in the book of Proverbs, chapter number 2, verse 1. My son, if you have said my words and heard my commandment within you, My son, if you have said my words and have my commandment within you, if you incline your ears to wisdom and direct your heart to understanding, if you truly call out to insight and lift your voice to understanding, if you may seek it like silver and search out like a hidden treasure. Oh, John, you will descend the fear of the Lord and discover the knowledge of God. Let me know the level of my days. Let me seek wisdom. Let me seek insight. Let me get understanding. So that it will become a treasure. An inheritance for hereafter. So you will discern the fear of the Lord. Who is a man that fears God? He's a man that is searching for every day. Let me know your ways. Let me know your ways, Lord. Let me love what you love. Let me hate what you hate. Let me search for understanding. Let me know the depths of your heart for me. Let me know the depths of your heart for me. Let me know the depths of your heart Amen. Amen. Ladies and gentlemen, Jesus said, the kingdom of heaven is like a treasure hidden in the field. And there is a treasure which is hidden by only wisdom, understanding, and a strength and time pursuit will cause us to discover. It's a one hour to show him, dear, and a rear bread and a near bread. I want to be so bitten in beer and I so bitten on Ruby. When a man finds that treasure, he hides everything that he has and go and buy that land. As when he per be a cock of Hunus, sir, a Japa, dear, yeah, I feel what I told you when you know the Cotosa Sassan. I told you that yesterday the Lord brought a sister into a hidden treasure for the husband family. 
Me catch a one upon us and no, a radius to Eddie and your barber con echo echo peer be a nicuno a japa dear a bonnet on a dear quacoche, and I said, Busy and my japa dear new radiano, a beer How many of us are searching for this eternal treasure? I know you are hungry, that is why you are here this afternoon. Now you mood do a say and a share da and quadia and I say and free something at the crowd dear as ye and a midi say a who come a deal pint in an area over high. I know without a doubt that any person that listen to Brother Gabriel, he's not listening to me because of any reason, but just because a person wants to make heaven. Now me jimmy and a minimum set will be very well with you so for Gabriel no and you be here. Who learned for death and doesn't come to the Lord? Who suffer hidden treasure and doesn't come to the Lord? When we hear at the Cradia and Ejapadia, SCA, no one mammy who radiate you, Queen. Come to the Lord! Bravo Radin Chain. Pursue him with all that you have within you. Call insight into your spirit. Let your voice to understand it. Now grant me understanding. Let God hear your voice of thing that you want him to do in your life. In Proverbs chapter 8 verse 17 he said, I love those who love me and I will hate those who hate me. Those who seek me shall find me. And I am the rewarder of those who diligently seek after me. Run to the Lord Jesus Christ. Run, run. America to America. Shine away anything that will can cost you. A dear Biara, a bear and my own to me who never radiates a crystal, no so chum of free home. Tell God to reveal the secrets that you need to know about Him to you. I catch a radis, a radi, and he entered the beer, a seal home, and I say, see, a seal me a minimum for one of Mr. Each. If at this end time the Lord had never warned you about something that Satan wants to use to destroy you, then be very careful that you are not close to the Lord. A better than us, a radi, a more coco, and father, a bonnet purpose, or they say one of one, let us say, oh, may a radi, and why are we ye? Seeking the Lord and seeking his money. See the Lord like you are seeking for a wife. See the Lord like you are seeking for a greener pasture. Because all other grounds are sinking sands. For the merchandise in the Lord is better than the merchandise of silver and gold. For the greatness in the Lord is better than all qualification in this life. Seek him than never before. Reject everything that Satan is using to entice or to block you from seeking the Lord. We need to come to know his ways, beloved. There are better things are waiting for you, I mean, heaven. There are better things, I bet you. The only person that I'm, I am jealous at is the person who has found the ways of God. A person who is standing before God and is not interested about anything around him, but all that is focused is Christ, Christ, Christ. The one thing that I desire that I may dwell in the presence of the Lord all the days of my life. 
That I may dwell in the presence of the Lord. Why? Because he's more profitable to me than silver and gold. When I find God, I find everything. My Jesus is more precious to me than rubies. Now, me yes to Christo no or some a bow as saying, Pastor, please have the assay the rubies in tree. Ah, rubies are they? I have sicker, 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 bitter, and as a day. Gritter, gritter, silver. Gritter, silver, and yare, obiati as a rubies. He is more precious to me than rubies. Sister, go to Proverbs chapter 13 for me. Proverbs chapter 13, let's go there. Proverbs 13, verse. Now let's read from verse 13. Blessed is the man who found wisdom, the man who acquired understanding. Do you hear? Yeah, yeah Obu Asem. First of all, you said Proverbs chapter 13, verse. Sorry, Proverbs chapter 3, 3 13. Yeah. Chapter 3, yeah. verse 13. Okay. For she is more profitable than silver. Mm. Mm. Oh, she is more profitable than gold. She is more precious than rubies. Oh, motor. <laughs> nothing, nothing should be desired, should be compared unto him. Oh, brother Gabriel, you are blessed. Oh, sister Cynthia, you are blessed. Who is the blessed person? Find any insurance. This time, those people who are blessed are not the people who are having the good minds to control. But a person, a person who have Christ on his side. A person who want Christ to be his prophet at the end of this journey. A person who is there arguing about doctrines. But a person who is seeking the love of God. Long life is in her right hand. We are sisters of Proverbs. And in your left hand are riches and honor. God have riches and honor awaiting for you. He has good things towards us. But he is inviting us to desire. His presence. Let it be your heart desire. Let it be your pursuit. No, no, wisdom is more precious than rubies. And nothing you desire must be compared with that. In the book of Proverbs, Jesus is the wisdom. In the book of Psalms, he is understanding. That is why King David was always saying, let me know this Jesus Christ. And Jesus in the book of John quoted that your fathers desire to see my days. And they desire to have what we have. 
To be part of this anti-minister that is gathering people for the Lord. Hi, I'm not waiting for anything, but I want to see your name written in the Lamb's Book of Life. Amen. A man who is blessed, her ways are pleasant. Now, Proverbs chapter 3, verse 17. He said, Her ways are pleasant, and all her paths are peaceful. All his ways, all his ways are pleasant. He's talking about a believer, an unbeliever. All his ways are pleasant. Why? Because he became the wisdom of God. And he lived with the wisdom every day. He doesn't compete with losers. Oh, I love that. They are losers. He doesn't compete with them, but he competes with those who are winning the race. Somebody, Gabriel, you want to tell me that all these people are going to have fire? Or who are working in, in losing? They are those who are losers. They are in losers' clothes. Are they all going to hell? Those who are losers don't compete with them. This is not a time to compromise. Those of you who have just joined, we are talking about the last trumpet will soon sound. That is the revelation the Lord gave to Sister Sylvia Kessie last night. The trumpet, he said, it is left with my last trumpet that is about to be sound. So the Lord is calling us to come to him and learn of him. Come for understanding. Come for wisdom. Know the season and the time where we find ourselves. Take his yoke upon yourself. Know his nature. He said, I am gentle and I am humble in heart. I am gentle and I am humble in heart. Meaning that you are the first person to say, I am sorry. You are the first person to take what nobody wants to do. You are the first last person to argue with somebody. You are the first person to argue with somebody. And you are the last person to compromise your faith. Jesus, I come and learn wisdom. Oh, why? Because wisdom is the tree of life to those who embrace her. Adam and Eve rejected the tree of life. 
na hawa ene adam ne hawa eposa enkwadu ye my improvise on the 3 verse 17 he said wisdom wisdom that's eating wisdom is the tree of life to those who embrace her and those who lay hold of her are blessed o se e enkwadu ya e ma wona wo so ni mu na enshira ene de wo kra mu blessed are you now you want to cling to jesus christ Ishrana was so person they were from in the radio Jesus Christ to him. He told Martha. I can't hear Martha. Martha, 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 you worry about so many things, but there is one thing that is good and your sister Mary have taken it and nobody will take it from her. Amen. I say Martha, how how who won near my bebre ho na dia ba ko pe e ne ho hia. E ne ne dia wonua Mary wa fa yi. Obi antumi nyi mfri ni nsamuda. Make your way pleasing unto the Lord. Make your way pleasing unto the Lord. And you won't fight any battle any longer. You will sleep and sleep. You will work and you don't feel tired. Oh, his strength will be your strength. His power will be your power. Proverbs chapter sixteen verse seven says, "If a man well pleases the Lord, he makes even his enemy to be at peace with him." Okay, me busem eti donsia imo. What's the place the verse? Verse seven. Imo sona se suoni pa kwa nse radi niya omanata fum po eni nintemba suli. God will make your enemies to become your friends if you want to please Him. Why? Because you're always seeking peace. Oh, you can't have peace for people and you can't have peace for people around you. And they are so precious to have. Oh, 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 I thank God that He has placed peace for people around me. I mean, there are the answers. So, what do you want to show some joy? A charm and wish. And the closest person with me, she is the most peaceful person I have ever found in my life. Now, there were family who had power, bearing so so. One only will be a will be a will tear some joy. I'm not going to my brother, but my face is a warm. I recently went with my wife into her brothers. And there was tension about certain issues. Na asembi esi efa asembi ho. And she was standing there. And the brothers are talking and talking and shouting and yelling. She was standing there and dancing. Na bro, na ni ni ano jina wano wati ya timu ni wani abrundi ano wajina wakra no wasa. I just look at her and I admire her. I say, wow. You are a precious jewel. I'm saying, ah, oh yeah, it's a party. I was sombo. Nothing concerns her. The baby, I'm fun. People were crying and they were shouting and raising their voice, and as if she is not part of it. I said, where is your secret, darling? And she said, ah, oh yeah, it's a party. I was sombo. I said, where is your secret, darling? I'm just saying, I'm saying, we're here to serve the day. She said, "I have gained understanding." Amen. We're so many answers. I have gained understanding. We're so many answers. I can't change the situation while I'm raising my voice. Mean to me, I'm fancy at the moon and so sad. I can't change the situation while I'm crying. Mean to me, I'm fancy at the moon and so sad. So I need to relax. I made the Lord take control. I have been. I am what I am not because of my own strength. Ababe drew the imagery and now my heart didn't be so. My mind is not given to such things. I mean, if I'm a dream, so am I near my sir. I've surrendered my will to Him. The Makwenye na Sherade. So anything that comes on my way. I know. He is still in control. Oh no, and I will be a danger now. Who is the man that can please God? Why anyone need to put me aside, Radian? He may think that's supposed to trouble you to bring you peace. Now, if the near man can watch the power of Brabham, be how in the midst of the storm you are so relaxing. 
The senior brother was amazed when she he came and saw my wife dancing. So, ah. Say so you can't do this, girl. Your junior sister is crying her heart out. Why don't you go and console her? When you are to her, and it was so hard, and I won't come and cock her, no. And I felt her saying that she had rejected what I have accepted. And I am a catcher, and I said, "One of our four dear men, my dear." She has refused what I value. Well, I'm running after. She have rejected that. Put your mind in the Lord. Because he, he is the tree of life to those who embrace him. And those who lay hold on her are blessed. You will go through problem, but it will never come near thee. Amen. You will be in a storm, but you will be sleeping while there is a storm. Because he is in the boat, and we will laugh and sleep. Bring Jesus in your boat. Nakim, you are rider. And relax in his arms. Seek understanding. Oh, because he has many good things for you. Our Lord has not brought us to this far to disgrace us. He wants to lead us in the path where his mercy and truth will keep us. And Psalm 25 has turned, let's go there. Psalm number 25 has turned. Let, let, let's, let's do at the end of verse 7. Let's start it from verse 7. Please read the verse 7 for me. Remember not the sins of my youth. And come in more fresh bone. All my rebellious acts. And I'm informed so. Remember me according to your loving devotion. And all translations are according to your loving kindness. Hmm. Because of your goodness, O oh God. Oh, there was nobody that knew God better in the days of David than any. He knew God. He had already given his heart unto God. So God gave him a title, a man after my own heart. This is the name that I believe you and me need to run after. Apart from David, only Jesus did God mention that name also. Now we David is in chain, yes, Christo, and it will be a rade at the said in and so a friend. Good and upright is in the Lord. Good and upright is found in the Lord. So that he continues to show sinners his ways. Let me know your ways. He will show it to us. He wants to show us his ways. And he will guide a number in what is right. The humble. He will guide the humble into what is right. Oh, the Lord will guide the humble into what is good. Now, Beloved, if there is anything I can give to you at this end time, is seek the face of the Lord. 
Amen. Or for some people who are meeting them over here, Bria, and I make us say, she she a radiant impa. Because his ways are loving and faithful to those who keep his covenant. It sounds say na kwa ni na aye ema wana wa kurana pam. Psalm number twenty five verse ten. All the Lord ways are loving. A radiant impa ni na aye adoye. And they are faithful to those who keep the commandment and his decrees. And then okure ema wana wodi na pam and then a dance the same song. For thy sin and for thy name's sake, O Lord, give me forgive my iniquity. I rather would him see for me born free me. Forgive my iniquity. For me born free me. Turn your eyes away from my sins. Now you were near free me born in so. For my iniquity is so great. I do so pee. No one can be for God with a proudful heart. Men far come on, men man who so emer ready any. Know that you are fallible. When you say, Pastor, please, how do I say the fallible? Who just seen it? And from so well, more you are a sinner. When you say we are the born yeni, and from so. Nobody is infallible before God. We be any who are we yeni mo na so want to see we ready any. So let's come before God, the Lord. Without you, I am nothing. Sansa bribi ebebe ready any be amani who no say so no ready and come who are yeni we. If you take your eyes away from me, I will be destroyed. I want you to be hungry for God more than anything. We have been given this privilege to run after him. Man generation is a blessed generation. I might want to talk to us. We, yeah, I want to talk to us. We ain't sure, pa. Because we are the people who have been given the fullness of the tree of life. So I say, yeah, and then come for a day, day, and quite be a no, you know, morning, you know, my. And we need to desire him more than anything. Nah, I was saying, I should show that now you can't do no. Don't be afraid of any man. Men strong, we need to be a. What can a man do to you? Again, only permit me there. Psalm number twenty-five, verse eleven, verse twelve. Who is the man who fears the Lord? Only permit me there. I will no. Him will the Lord show how to put to to, to choose the best. But you're not quite your own first. Who is the man who fears the Lord? Only permit me there. I will swear no. He, the Lord, will instruct and but show him his ways that he should choose. The Lord will instruct you and me. I ready a bit sure me know me know. And show us what to choose. Now, but for a bit sure in there, what's it? Yeah, yeah. I was talking to one of our of our sister this morning. I know, but I'm new in your Baba. And considering how far she has come with certain issues. Now, we hear and pen pen swa what they and send be a Baba dra. Up and down that she has gone through the struggle that she has gone through. For the past twelve to fifteen years. Now, uh, we can't walk back. Asamba could be home. Be in fear. Do me, no name. And she asked me, Brag Ebra, about why? Why is God silent on this? I know this time I said, I should forgive her. Now then, I read it. I said, why you didn't walk? And she said, "Many of us, we made choices. Our early choices concerning our future, we made it without God." And I see you be brave, no? You see, so no, na eh, dear, ye ye di kai no. Ya ankasa ya mukwe ya kwenbi ya ya mfera dia mamu bi. How many of us prayed to God before we get a job that we are doing? Ye mu do do sa ne ba mpai chere rade an sa ne juma yu mu se se no. How many of us pray to God before we went to the church where we are now? And sorry, be brave. We must not just say we are born pious, son of Yeko. The husband, the wife. How many of us prayed until God said, "Yes, this is he. This is she." Before you took him or her. Yeko no ana ya yere. We must not just say we are born pious, my radical son. I onu ni ana ya farm. Some of us even were fighting God and said, "No, no, she is too no." Pastor, please come again. Some of us were fighting God, even when God told our husbands and wives. 
yemu bina yani erade ko se debi debi erade nyo no ni ewe de nyo no today some of us when we sit back and see the kindness of God the Lord I love you ene yemu bi se etna se ni ehwe erade adoya wode adoya se erade Some of us are crying because we refused to wait on God yesterday. Who is the man that feared the Lord? Him would the Lord instruct the way he should choose. Hallelujah. Amen. Where you are now? Was the Lord who chose to for you who taught you how to choose? If not, then start changing things. Tell yourself I've come too far to make the same mistake that I made yesterday. <laughs> Advise yourself that you have come too far to make the same mistakes. So who for say what Bible drew and pen pen so be a what's a sir and from so no any kind of way some from so. And I want to go back to my own ways again. I don't want to do things that were unprofitable to my soul again. I don't want to do things that were unprofitable to my soul again. Beloved, if you have this opportunity, let us make good use because time will be too late for us. Time is no more. Time is no more. Therefore, let us choose and choose better. Let's remove all hindrances and excuses. And drop every weight that can easily contaminate this grace that we have. So that our souls will dwell in prosperity. And our descendants will inherit the land. The Lord wants you and me to prosper. This afternoon, one of my daughters were testifying the goodness of the Lord. And she said, Daddy, it seems God is blessing me too much. <laughs> And The Lord is showing me dreams and vision these days. I'm improving in my academic performance. And daddy, I went to shop just a few minutes. Everything I wanted was there. <laughs> Uh, Pastor, please come again. She went to shop to buy uh, something that she wants. And everything that she wanted, when she wanted everything, everything was there. Of course, I got a and I didn't even know how much I saw it. No, I didn't even know how This is the goodness of God to her. In the way, in the radio, I don't know why I am now. Your descendants will inherit the land, and they will dwell in prosperity and joy and fulfillment. Amen. Was it for the first? I seen it in Robert. Seen it in the day. Any energy? Good and upright is of the Lord. Um, ye ene tene ne ewe radio. The steps of the righteous men are ordered by God. Se e radio etu to at a atene for kwai ema wong. Let us run unto God. Into America and kwai radio. And change what needed to be changed now. There is a song that a Ghanaian lady sang. I don't like the girl, but I like the words. He said, if I know the day that I left with me, I will pursue God. When I remember the day that I have spent in sin, 
na enyum bi wo ho aga na ni aba ye bi eto ye me mpe ono anka sa de ba enyum ni munsem no ya sa wo mo pa wo se senka eh eh me na ma di etwe mu no senka me nya mra anka me de be ka de menye ihu if i can change what i should change yesterday i would have changed it aka me tumi asesa the Anakan was a Mrs. Sank, Mrs. Sam. My mistake that I made yesterday that cost me. If I can change it, I would have changed it. Now, from Sobia, me and Enrano, and Kakwenya Bassa was a Mrs. Sana, a Kamasa Sana. If I could turn the clock, many of us would turn the clock. And commit me a Danet than a near me near, more than a running now, Kamasa Sana. But don't cry, because there is hope for tomorrow. You are wasted yes, it's going to be turned around for your good. My Jesus, my Savior is more than able to turn the clock for your good. Focus on him because he is your future. Don't think about your past because you can't change it. Come to the Lord. Seek him. Allow him to influence your choices. If, if you can really testify that your past was full of mistakes. Now, we are correct your future. Correct your future. Change the future. Look for a better future. Look for a joyful future. Look for a peaceful future. Embrace the tree of life. Allow him to be all that you need. Allow him to be everything that you want. And I assure you. You will dwell in prosperity. Now the conclusion of our message is Ecclesiastes chapter 12 verse 13. After all has been heard the matter, the conclusion of the matter is Fear God and keep his commandment from today. Because this is the whole duty of man. Maybe you never knew it yesterday. Yesterday is gone. I never day has come. Do We 
without you. We can all live without you. We can all live without you. Oh, Lord. I cannot move without you. I cannot I can't help without you. I can't help without you. Can I help without you? I can't help without you. Oh. Is there anything in your life that you can't live without? Jesus. Let that be with Jesus. There is nothing in this life. Not your soul, my desire. I was say a precious shit. Apart from Jesus. There is nothing at this end time. Now you and me must spend time, money, and energy on. Apart from Jesus. Ladies and gentlemen, we are not to add nor subtract from the commandment of God. But rather we've been given to keep them. So that God will bless us. As I'm bringing my message to an end, I want you to prepare your heart and bring your heart before God. That make me your sanctuary, O God. The Lord sent Brother Apia to me and said, God said, build an altar for him. Altar basically is a meeting place of prayer. I don't know where, either to build an altar in Leicester City or to build an altar on Facebook or Internet. Yeah. And what the Lord is saying is, those who will come to that altar and meet me, I will take them when I come. Amen. I'm appealing to everyone that listens to my teachings. I beg you, give your all to Christ. Let nothing be anything good for you to live for in this life apart from Jesus Christ. Dedicate your heart wholly and fully unto him. And let him to be owner of your soul. Amen. Amen. Pray this prayer after me if you want to say Jesus. Jesus. I give you my heart. I give you my heart. I give you my mind. I give you my mind. I surrender my all to you. I surrender my all to you. Be the owner of my soul. Be the owner of my soul. Guide me in all truths. Guide me in all truths. Forgive me of everything that is not of you. Forgive me of everything that is not of you. Let me live for nothing apart from you. Let me live for nothing apart from you. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. I come I come be dehino ma bra bosso. Be dehino ma bra bosso. Be mani ma mi unu ni awu unu. Be mani ma mi unu di awu unu. Be masuma mente ni awo tiye. 
Mama come and need your wood Mama come and need your wood I'm a cramp baby. I will walk. I'm a cramp baby. I will walk. I want some bomb, mamma, and chain at dinner. I want some bomb, mamma, and chain at dinner. I meant nothing, and quite knock Amen. Jimmy Free, we are Deliver me from every sin in this world. Anything that want to hold me captive, Lord, set me free. Yes, Jesus, prepare me, Jesus. Prepare me, prepare me before you come. The Lord want to prepare your heart this afternoon. Everybody, give me Lord, take my will and give me your will. Yes, I want you to talk to God. I want us to talk to God. Talk to God. Come out of your heart. There might be something sad. There might be something sad that I've touched your heart so much. Yeah. When I was a little boy, this was the master that I used to love. The master that put tears in my heart. The master that bring grief into my spirit. And caused me to pursue the Lord than never before. Uh, a master that gave me the audacity to surrender my ways to him. <laughs> Dedicate your heart unto him. <laughs> the Lord, I give you my heart. <laughs> I give you my soul. <laughs> I want to live for you. <laughs> All the days of my life. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Break every yoke. Destroy every hedges. Destroy everything. Snatch your soul, O oh God. Oh, Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Oh, my, my Jesus. Win them for yourself, my God. Oh, I'll Jesus. declare what you want them to hear, oh God. Oh. I'll declare what you want them to hear, oh God. Oh. Touch lights. Touch lights. In the name of Jesus. For I give you my Lord, I'm your separate Lord, unto you. I give you my soul. My, 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 I want to live for you, Lord. Have your way, have your way, have your way in me. Lord, I give you my soul. 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 I live for you alone. Every brother I take. Every moment I am awake, love you, Lord. I give you my heart. Shandere bo saka ba 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 ba. I give you my soul. I live. Every breath that I say. Every moment of my work, when I'm awake, I'm your work. Lord, I give you my heart. I 
I give him my hand. Draw me close to you, draw me close to you. Never, you never let me go. You're my desire. She, my, 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 Let the Lord host your future. Let Jesus give your future to the Lord. The Lord have messed up. I've not messed up in my marriage. I've messed up in my upbringing. I've messed up in my school education. The Lord, I want you to mess up in my having a race. Have your way. I want to say, 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 I because I give you the rest, I give you the rest of my life. Now have your way. Because you're all I want. You're all I ever needed. You're all I want. Help me know you are near. Singing your own. You're all I want. I need you, Lord. Father, I thank you because you love us. Lord, I give you all the reverence and adoration. I bring your children before you. You said that I should set an altar for you. Where you will select those who belong to you. I minister your word of season to your children. I pray the Lord, those who have prayed, you add more strength, more power, and more energy. Father, so that every strength that they need to fulfill this call, they will grab it in Jesus' name. Those who are weak, Lord, I cry that you will strengthen them. Those who are weak, I pray that you will strengthen them. Those whose strength are weak, Lord, grant them more strength. Those who lack understanding, give them understanding. Those who lack knowledge, please grant them knowledge. Let them be established in your will. I pray for more grace to function in your obedience. In the name of Jesus, Amen. fight every battle in their lives, O God. Amen. Bring them into an area where they will surrender their lives to you. Jesus. Seize every opportunity that Satan has taken in their life. Oh, Influence their choices, O God, and fulfill your will in their life. Amen. Thank you because you love us. Yes, For in Jesus' name we pray. Mm. Amen. Amen. People, before we go, I want to give opportunity, if anybody has a question or had a message, a testimony or a dream to share, before we go. Yes. Brother Eric, your hands is up, sir. Amen. 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 Since this senior now one weekend me me so that he be na a far one na I'm sorry. Um, I remember I was um for that pier on your own fishing so I was say uh what type of I say and I just say she got there and I'm I'm a I confirm me you know I'm saying me me catch me na my mother just say me catch but now me me friend him catch I say who which one say which one I can't be certain sir. For about say days ago, Mama Esther, do you want to do it for me, please? No, 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 it's enough. You've done enough. God bless you, darling. You've done well. You've done well. You've gone extra, my God bless you. 
For about six days ago, or a few days ago, I had a vision about you, Brother Gabriel. I was contemplating to share it with you, but within my spirit, it looked as if I was asked not to share it now. But just to confirm what Brother Apia just spoken to you about. Brarek? Hello. Hello. Na efa o e wo hu na em ai se o krum ya ko ho na ne be ba ho na u china oni ko fo bia se ase asase bi asase bi o gana na e se papa ai se o da ma o se una o da e o da ti wo hu fa ya fi ti o se o mo fa gbe da nyu so ne o fa si asori dai e look i say that we've gone back to your city your hometown and there is a plot or a land and apparently you were saying that that land was given to your father, handed it over to you, and you don't know what to use the land for. Therefore, you want some graders just to uh, grade the, the ground and so that you build a church on that uh, 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 land. And I think that I was the Kukuni and the Bible that this woman shall see the trend and no money that they just said, Now, when we have a patient, I would know how I wish and I would shall see a year to man. And I saw that there was like a cocoa farming land and they were cutting everything, weeding everything, cocoa farms and all the plantations on it so that you can prepare the ground to build a church. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't understand it because the Lord is saying that these days is not a time to build churches but a time for more of evangelism. So I was asking contemplating God. So God, what is the meaning of this? Auntie, um, brother, if you did buy now, I'm having a confirmation. Auntie, I say more. Say okay. Say. So one after I have heard what you mentioned that Brother Pia share with you, it is granting me more understanding and clarity to also to tell you. God bless you. I think Brother Pia is here. Ajah Pia. Ajah. I've already told you. <laughs> maybe I thought that maybe the Lord has, has told you another thing again. No worries. Share it again with us so that the people will know that what I'm saying, I'm not saying what I want. Come here, my auntie. I was asleep this morning. I have a dream. And the person that took me, I uh, met Pastor Gabriel. And I was told that he has gathered many people around where he is. So he said, the master that he has given to you, Lord, all those people around you come closer and pay attention to what you are saying because that is the altar that God will reveal himself through to his people. But 50% this is the portion that took me that the many people that came half of them went and did not practice what we are being taught here so Amen. So the Lord was... That is it. 
So what the law was, the voice was telling me that this, what this gentleman is doing is the way that I'm going to save my people, those who are listening to his voice and obeying exactly what he's telling them. These are the people that I'm going to bring them. So I want to advise all of us, please, as many that come and listen to these teachings, please, 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 I beg you, practice them as it is, because I am practicing it. That gives the power for you to be hungry more for it. Other than that, you won't desire it. It pains me that some of where we are born into church, but we are not taking things seriously. Especially people can read. I can read as people can read better. I'm saying this, if I am able to read as many people are able to read and write things, many people, instead of reading the Bible and lining up their line with, they are reading newspapers. Even in the church, some people take newspapers in the church. Today, some people are sitting in the church and they are, they are, they are, they are playing up with, with their phones. Somebody might be sitting at home, listening to this message, and then he's playing up with his phone or her phone. May God forgive all of us. And run on to God, because this is a time to be very serious with the Lord. Amen. Amen. Yes, brother. first, Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. It's the greatness of God. Before I entered into the kingdom of darkness, into the marine world, I always dreamt about a very big hand covering me, holding me, and moving me around. And, uh, when I went into the kingdom of darkness, that hand stopped. When I came out, the hand came back again. After I married, the hand disappeared again. Hmm. Just today, the hand, I saw the hand following me everywhere I go. And I saw the lights reflecting on my head. And my family members were all bowing before me like Joseph. Meaning that you are the Joseph in your family. So simple. I didn't at the bamboo. A chair coin, a yansa, a GM flew a howny at its simo. Meaning, sir, now send a wusso, never addressing a bassa cassette that was in Timmy's room. No coming in our son and son of the Sukutau. Found on Hoshan and Sanimo. Found Hoshan and Sanimo and a bassa cassette and a mood do say, said the other what's it? I mamma and near my woman will fear not. And she might be named for Uncle Vias, Miss Rawa. That is the wisdom. That is the wisdom. Leave that thing to go. Amen. Amen. Never allow anything which is pulling you to each side to hold you. Leave that thing. Let that thing go. The more they pull you, the swifter and the quicker you need to let your hands go. And it go away speedily from your side. Adi bi ara elchin wo. Ibi a wo di ya waria. Ibi a wo di isi kasembi a ya juma. Ibi a yuhiya. Ibi a adwenvene. Jebu me brade na brade mfanko. Na nyame de kwa wo de nepa bebrao. Ensi ukraye. Amen. Amen. I have about ten minutes. If there is any question on Facebook, any question on the platform, is there any question? Mami Lucy, akwaba. Hehehehe. Eba chwa wa sembisa. Meba wa sisi siya. Nyabu terema me. Meba wa nchen sisi siya. Is there any question? Is there any revelation? Fawa kwa asha. 
sister on Facebook, we love you. We are about to close. I want you to commit your ways unto God. Commit your ways unto God. Anything I want to take you, leave it. Anything I want to pull you into darkness, let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. The best are yet to come. The best are yet to come. God bless you, baby. John, God bless you. Sister B, God bless you. Commit your way. Commit your way. Say, Lord, have your own way. Have your own way. Everybody. Now, I'm ready. I'm ready. Sister Joyce, your hands is up finally before we share the grace. And the Joyce. Hallelujah. Amen. This morning I have a dream. It's, it's like we all have gathered in the church and after the church service. You are the first person to drive your car away. So I question why is that pastor is living today so quick? So some of us wanted to follow you and see why you are driving quickly away from the meeting. Not knowing that God has revealed something to you, so as you were proceeding and going there, there were demons who have barricaded you and they wouldn't like you to cross that area. So you came out of the car? Na se uto won saba kwa at the same nipa best a thousand. So when you when you throw one of your hands, it looks as a thousand people are throwing blows. I said Jana a dear money no dolphin, but omokan shia de crana omunti wo. The demons were so many, 
But despite all their incantation, they were not able to proceed. So we were three people that came into your aid. So we, we concluded that, wow, this was the revelation that a man of God saw, and he refused to let us know, and he came so that he would come and fight these demons here. And from there I came, I, 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 I became awake. Amen. Amen. Shall we stand against every resistance? Every spirit that is holding people from entering into heaven, shall we pray? Every demon, shall we pray? Fire of God against you. Fire of God against you. You contaminate your spirit, your kingdom of darkness that are holding people, that are holding people from entering into heaven. I command you in the name of Jesus. Lose them, lose them, lose them and let them go. Those who are bound in alcoholism, fornication, adultery, pornography, be loose in the name of Jesus. Bad marriage, bad relationship, be set loose in the name of Jesus. Lose them and let them go. Physical weaknesses, physical weaknesses, and the sickness and disease, and the infirmity and weaknesses. In the name of Jesus, be lost and lose. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, be set loose. Father, may your power set your people free. Amen. May your power set your people free. Amen. Holy Ghost fire. 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 Set your people free, O God. Shandelele bo sata ya ba onyamija. Onyamija honkun kuruje. Honkun kuruje bo ura humo. Bo ura humo na mo fa hudiye. Bora uma na mo fa hudiye. O ma shekere bo sata ya. He ra ba 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 pray. Pray receive the fire of God. Receive the fire of God to come out of every weaknesses. To come out of every excuses. Shandere ya ba ba yanda ra ba shekata ya ba ba. Mandere bo seka bro sheketa ya ba ba shaka ya ba ba. Ma 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 sendere bo shaka ya ba. Hela ma ma sondoro bo kotoro bo sheka ba ya ba ba. Oba ma onsa swa ma ma yenshro abrante. Oba ma onsa swa ma ma yenshro abrante. What about you and if I would ever bow my you will raise up your hands that we will become blessed, O oh God. You will bring redemption, freedom, and peace, joy, and satisfaction in following you, O oh God. Say that if we love you, you cause us to enjoy prosperity in all the days of our lives. We thank you, Lord, for in Jesus' name we pray. Mm -hmm. Anyone that is going through sickness, I declare, be healed in Jesus' amen, name. Amen. Anyone going through any infirmity, I declare, oh, be free Jesus. in amen. Jesus' name. Amen. amen. Let every thought that is standing against God concerning your love, that it be destroyed in yes. Jesus' amen. name. I approach them right now. Oh, and I stand and I say, be broken and be destroyed. Amen. Let us strong go come down in Jesus' name. Amen. Jesus. Father, thank you for setting your people free. Amen. And giving them the strength to walk yes, in your Lord. counsel. Yes, Lord. We give you praise. Amen. I give you worship. Now Amen. and forevermore. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Beloved, those of you who are on Facebook, if this message has entered into your life, I want you to reach out to me either on WhatsApp, on Facebook, on YouTube. And let us have one-on-one -on -one so that we can share the word of God. I'm willing to pray with you. As many are here, your room is still waiting for you. Come and let us serve God together. I don't know Facebook or not. I don't know Facebook or not. I don't know if you are on Facebook or not. I don't know if you are on Facebook. Now I contact me WhatsApp. 
Yawa, yan church, baby, ewa YouTube, baby, so so, ewa internet radio, so. Na ni open se uti ana se uhunu wa we ye bre e rade de ahye yen sase yen fa mao bra na woni yen sumo mom na wa bra bo enye sara biara da everything that you need to know about this end side every preaching that you want to hear that can prepare a person for heaven by the grace of the lord god he has granted us access to that so please desire to come closer and let us share fellowship together Shall we all in one accord share the grace together? Young can Adam and seven. Now may the grace of our Lord and our Savior Jesus Christ, the love of God, the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit, be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our life. And we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. God bless all of your Facebook. I love you and God Richard bless you. God bless you. We meet tomorrow, God's willing. There is uh tonight there is a meeting going on. Uh now, right now, Pastor Henry and Sister Kessie have started a meeting. Please quickly go there. Go for top up.